in the Food Lion Kitchen with Bobby from Carlos Brazilian. David, this is Bobby. Hi. Bobby, pleasure to meet um, you. Same here. Bobby is my favorite guest, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> 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 because he always he has delicious desserts. Good food. <laughs> yes. So today we're doing a ricotta cheesecake. Correct. Right? It's a very simple recipe. You have like uh, cream cheese. We start off with uh, pounded that. Then we'll do like 15 ounces. It costs for 12, but it goes by 15 ounces in the container, so I'm using all of it. I usually like to cream my cream cheese first before I start it. Then add your ricotta. That's something different versus always like a regular cheesecake. Right. And uh, you recommend whole milk ricotta, not part skim, right? Yeah, I could. I mean, you could do part skim, but. Yeah, yeah. yeah you know, we're here to have fun. Exactly. Yes. You could choose. <laughs> well, now you can cream them together the cream cheese and your ricotta. Just for now. You can add some sugar. What makes this uh, cheesecake a little lighter is the orange zest. You're gonna bring out so much flavor to it. It doesn't call for vanilla, but we decided to add vanilla. Why not? Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Yeah. <laughs> it's Tuesday. Let's do it. <laughs> and we're also gonna have uh, honey. Oh, look at that. The thing is, like, now it's allergy season, and ah. they say if you get the honey from the local area, it's good for allergies. So you, if you take that, you'll be forced to eat cheesecake to feel better. Oh, you're turning into a healthy recipe. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Bobby. I like this. Mm -hmm. It's getting better and better. Mm -hmm. You can just scrape it down. And you can use any any kind of honey you want. It right? usually says clove honey or like those Orange blooms. blossoms. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So we add the mm. honey in there. So it's, we're already halfway there. I got to add the eggs. And I'm pairing up our Grand Marnier for this oh, recipe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Cheers. Mm. Yes. I don't think I'm gonna drink this. <laughs> <laughs> Down the hatch. Man, it smells foul. And then you can drop one egg at a time. <laughs> okay. You yeah, right there? <laughs> I'm okay. I'll get a beer to wash that down. Be right. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little strong. You just gotta sip on it. But uh, it makes a great flavor, I bet. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So now when you have everything mixed up, it took us about a whole two minutes. You put it in your shell. And you have like a graham cracker yeah, well, crust, right? Yep. You, you can do any mm -hmm. crust you want. Something you could do also, like since you're doing with ricotta and do a more Italian style, you could do like a biscotti cookie crumb or something like that. Well, why didn't you do that, Bobby? I'm sorry. <laughs> fail. That was a fail. <laughs> I'm not your favorite anymore. <laughs> I, I know. That went out the window. Do you want to try to batter what it's going to taste like? Uh, yeah. Oh, I know yeah. you're a batter person. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's thick and creamy. <laughs> you want some? Uh, you didn't right, I do. <laughs> I was hoping you'd offer. Mm. And then I paired I it up. I just eat that oh, out that's of the delicious. bowl. <coughs> then I paired up a little bit of peach puree. I know it's peach end of puree. summer, so a lot of people having a bunch of fruits in their freezer. Oh my Don't know gosh. what to do with it. Look at it. Delicious. Peach puree. That looks delicious. Look at that. Mmm. Jackpot. Oh, Thank that you. is so home good. Run. That is a home run right there. Wow. Very good. Well, enjoy the rest of the show, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> no. See you later. You won't be the first to be doing that, so <laughs> yeah, that's all I right. I bet you I wouldn't be. I know that's right. <laughs> all right, so we're going to offer up the recipe wow. for this ricotta cheesecake on our website, daytimebluridge.com. Just click on the food tab and look for a ricotta cheesecake. Mm. And in the meantime, definitely check out Carlos Brazilian. Have you eaten? Oh, yes. yes. Oh, yeah. I lived in that neighborhood. Oh, we go I there. thought you were going to say, I it. live in that restaurant. Not in that restaurant, <laughs> but oh, my, oh, yeah. We <laughs> love that restaurant. Always good. Uh, 4167 Electric Road, sort of catty corner from the Tanglewood Mall, 776 1117 to make your reservations, especially on weekends. Mm. And carlosbrazilian.com. Bobby, you guys have any anything big coming up? Um... We're open for lunch. I know wedding seasons that start off like the fall part. I do mm. wedding cake, so if you give me a heads up. If you need a wedding cake, give me a call. Yes, you make beautiful. Bobby makes beautiful cakes. If you haven't seen them, go to the Facebook page. You post a lot of your, your desserts on yep. there. All you right, make a Bobby. wedding cake out of this right here. That'd be fantastic. Yes, <laughs> I have done also. <laughs> Thanks, Bobby.